Honey it's, mustard. It's honey mustard. It's honey mustard. All right. <laughs> it's <yellow>. <laughs> <laughs> this is ranch. This one was spicy aioli, mm -hmm. chipotle ketchup, and honey mustard. So whenever I'm with my wife, it's whenever we're nearby Gus's place, she's like, hey, let's stop and get one of those dipping dogs. And if you take a look at them, they're, they're not the corn dogs you have at your state fair. These are big honking monsters. <laughs> so two of these really will fill you up, unless you're a 17 year old teenager. Then you need about 12. Country fried bacon. So we have his deep fried chili ball. So it's got the same coating as the dipping dog. So it's a cornbread coating with chili stuffed in the middle. Do you know how he stuffs the chili? It might be magic, but we might have to ask <laughs> Gus. I think we're going to have to ask Gus about that. <laughs> Everything here has been magic. <laughs> so what do you think of the deep fried chili ball? It's good. <laughs> the question is, Gus, mm -hmm. how do you get the chili inside the chili ball. Well, that's kind of a proprietary little uh, <laughs> technique we have. So it is magic. <laughs> is there anything you won't fry? Or what have you tried to fry and hasn't yeah, worked? Yeah, yeah, that's a better question. You know what, I tried coating the french fries, you know, see, see if you know, have like the coated seasoned fries. That didn't work out so well. <laughs> so... I like big burgers and I cannot lie. Burgers and they, it's a really great piece of meat, but the bun it's just that right, it can't garbage, and you're eating it by the time you're halfway through, it's paste. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You might as well have eaten it open faced. Right. So, this is a lot sturdier, you know, causes like his homemade knot roll. It does, it holds all this just amazing wow. goodness. <laughs> but you see what I mean? Like, you need to <clears throat> handle this guy. Kind of got like hunched over. Do the wedge. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Wow. That is nice. impressive. Well done. Mm -hmm. Let me see my, yep, my lovely. Yep. There's, there's the hands. A sign of a good burger. I'd say avoid my face at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> I'm focusing on your hands. <laughs> what didn't we have? So we had country fried bacon, which is deep fried bacon if that's not obvious enough. We had country fried pickles. We had chili bombs, which were chili balls. I mean, just stuffed with chili. We had dipping Corn dogs, bread. which are the biggest corn dogs you've ever seen. Of course, we had fried jalapenos, which were okay. amazing. Country fried corned beef, mm -hmm. which was amazing. And if that wasn't enough, because I'm still always hungry, I had to get the <laughs> one pound undisputed you burger, did. which is about the size of my head. Yeah. Yes, it is. Yeah. So we've got pictures to prove it. Yes. Uh, and each dish came with a different sauce. So we had spicy aioli, we had uh, curry, uh, Wait, curry ketchup. ketchup, we had uh, chipotle ketchup. I think we had regular ketchup at some point. We had honey mustard, regular mustard. We had an olive oil aioli. Um, we had Texas ranch. Texas ranch. There was a tzatziki is that sauce. Tzatziki mm -hmm. um, sauce. What else? There was there was a Thousand Island type of sauce. Wasn't we did. There. Uh, Argentinian aioli. And that's something that he has a new sauce every week. So definitely some of the secret items that you can get here at Wiener and still champion. And what was your favorite? Terms besides of my sauces, a burger, yes. Well, in, in, in anything besides a burger. Besides a burger, you know, I got to tell you, deep fried bacon. How can you really go wrong? I figured you put bacon on a bumper and you'd eat it, and I probably <laughs> nice. would. You'd try. I would try. Might hurt my mm, teeth. Your birthday's coming up. That's Let's right. see what we can do about that. <laughs> anything with bacon. <laughs> All right. What was your favorite treat? Uh, the corned beef, which surprised me. I was really excited about the deep fried pickles because I'd had those for the first time in Memphis, but I really liked the deep fried corned beef and the jalapenos were awesome too. Yeah. And All they right. are at 802 Dempster in Evanston. All right. Anything else you want to say? tell me I didn't ask you? You know, any city dwellers can always just hop on the L, get off on Dempster, and there you go. No car required. We are the champions, my friend.